Well, it'll be hard to ignore the sound of racing in downtown St. Pete this weekend. The 2020 Indy Car Series kicks off with the St. Pete Grand Prix, a race that's been part of the city since 2005. And you may be familiar with the race, but how much do you actually know about the cars and the series itself? We'll get you ready to rev your engines. We're going beyond the headline to learn more. The sights and sounds of Indy cars are unmistakable. Unless you confuse them with their cousin, the Formula One car. But that's a whole different beyond the headline. Indy cars are open wheel race cars where a single driver sits in an open air cockpit in the middle of the car. Unlike NASCAR, which is stock car racing, where the driver position and basic shape of the car is much more similar to the cars you and I drive every day. Indy cars use a twin turbocharged V6 engine that puts out between 550 and 700 horsepower. That's a lot of horses. Combine that with these cars that weigh around 1,600 pounds, and they can get going pretty darn fast. Top speeds are estimated around 235 miles an hour. The fastest race ever saw average speeds of 207, and those speeds can make for some pretty tight racing. In fact, since the series started in 1996, there have been eight races where the top three finishers were separated by less than a tenth of a second. The IndyCar series also races a wide variety of tracks, everything from traditional ovals, like the Indy 500, to permanent road courses, to temporary street courses, like the St. Pete Grand Prix.